Thanks for staying with us tonight. Now, if you have a pacemaker, listen up here. There is a new warning. The FDA says that the magnets in cell phones may affect implanted medical devices. Now, the FDA is aware that some consumer devices like cell phones or smart watches have magnets in them that may cause implanted devices to go into a magnetic safe mode and temporarily suspend normal operation. So try to keep these electronics at least six inches away from any implanted medical devices. The FDA believes that the risk to patients is low at this point, but it is certainly something to keep an eye on. And digital cryptocurrencies exploded last year and this year, with, but with it come scams. With so many Americans eager to get on the new trading, scammers were ready. According to NBC News, a federal investigation found that thousands of people reported losses of more than $80 million since October due to these scams. The report also said the most targeted age group was 20 to 49 years old. And we've all seen that tap feature on the credit card machine when we go to the checkout counter. Touchless shopping increased during the pandemic because consumers wanted to buy items with as little contact as possible. But self-checkout stands and tap-and-go payments, they're here to stay, but it could replace workers, especially women, according to NBC News. Now, these payments make shopping easier, but put those retail jobs at risk while temp tech companies continue to flourish. Patagonia, Honda, Moderna, Chick-fil-A, and SpaceX have the top five best reputations among consumers, according to this year's Axios Harris Poll 100, which ranks companies that consumers seem to like the most. Now, Chewy, Pfizer, Tesla, Costco, and Amazon rounded out that top ten. The survey measures how corporate visibility, trust, and culture, as well as the products and services the company provides and how consumers react.